Vou prender aí. Seventy degrees. Keep it warm. All right. Let's go. All right, ladies and gents. Opening day in New York. God bless. The season is upon us. October 1st. Good luck to everybody. Any other states opening today? Maybe yesterday there was a few opening. Good luck to everyone this hunting season. Be safe. Have fun. And just enjoy doing what you love. What a unreal afternoon. It's kind of warm. It's going to be warm for the next week. So not expecting insane good hunting buck wise. But it's opening day. You got to get in the bush and enjoy that bush. It's certainly nice to be in open air, but that's kind of why I chose to come to this ghillie blind instead of a hard hard blind, because at least I'm, I'm in somewhat open air. Um, but you can get away with filming and a little bit of movement, you know, below the, the window line. So I just want to observe this field and see these deer are getting into the beans right now. The, the fence is no longer hot. You know, it's kind of gotten shorted out by the bean growth and everything. So the deer are learning that very quickly. But I just want to kind of observe what they do to it. And I want to see, you know, if we get anything else that I haven't seen on camera coming out here. My wind's good. It's just drifting in the face, but it's pretty damn dead still. Rub a little calming zone around the blind or around your tree, around your tree, on your boots, on yourself, whatever. But... It just smells like, it smells like deer. It smells like a deer bedding area. And uh, you can kind of use it as a cover scent it when it's still, especially it'll calm the deer down. I've seen it work so many times. deer come out in the field. It's funny. They clearly don't care about the fence at all. Now that it's not hot. If I want to keep them off this field a little bit longer, I'm going to have to recharge that battery and get it going for another week or so. But they walk, they jump right through it, walk right under it. Don't matter. basically out of camera light anyway, but the deer cleared off the field, so and it's so quiet, it just unzipping that ghillie and wanted to sneak out while I could. But pretty, pretty evening. So I don't know, maybe six or seven deer, a couple small bucks, and a couple doe. And uh, it was a pleasant, pleasant sit. Happy October 1st and opening day. Across the country. Season 2023 is upon us. Check in with my dad, see what he saw, but it's a good night. We got Dave coming into camp for a quick afternoon sit. He's in for a wedding this weekend, so he's gonna get a bonus bonus hunt at camp and tomorrow afternoon, so looking forward to it. The chase is on. Y'all see what that is? That's the hill. The hill. The hill. Your boy is making a celebrity, not so celebrity guest, not so guest appearance up to Camp Cutlet. It's October 2nd, second day of the season. We had a wedding in town this weekend. Couldn't get up here for opening day, but you damn sure know that I'm gonna slide in here when given the opportunity even if it's only for an afternoon hunt and get one in and you're damn right that's what we're doing today camp cutlet i mean i'm questioning the uh vehicle choices here we got the uh, corolla toyota corolla 02 maybe and uh 
the Tacoma. Come on, boys, where are the big wheels at? Back. Camp, baby, look. New addition. Cherry bomb. Right when you walk in. Next to Spiny Jr. Cherry bomber and got another one, four four bucks now in the kitchen. Jamario Jr. Nice buck. Nice buck, UJ. Hell of a job we got. Old Don and Nipsey, the two kings in the corner. Five minute, nine hour. Mystery 8. Thanksgiving. Buck, hook. First good one ever. Daggers. And then we got a slicky in the corner. Oh, this is Dean's Ohio mount. New pack mount. Look at that thing. You get to yaw. Uh, that is sick. Wow, that's cool. That's really cool. Well, I'll be. We got four, new, three new ones in here. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Well, snuck up for one afternoon up at camp. See that little sneakerooski. That day two of the season. Little, little October thunder. Are you going in tonight? Yeah. And just, I, just later. Just later. Going in. See it sunset. Not before. <laughs> you get the drop off up here. some spideys in here. Alright you guys, your boy is here, New York, in the bush, ready to roll. This is sick. Did not expect to be here. Second day of the season. <clears throat> and I'm here, baby. I had a wedding in town. Made the last minute decision to come up. Dean and my dad have been up here since uh, yesterday or the day before. They hunted yesterday. Not a ton of activity. But maybe today will change. I don't have a lot of expectations. Honestly, I'm just glad to be here. So I'm just going to sit here and enjoy the evening that I have. So I'm overlooking a very, very beautiful clover plot that we have. And it is surrounded by apple trees. So we've been getting a lot of daylight photos in this in this particular plot um, over the last couple weeks. So I'm, I'm just hoping to see some deer tonight. And hey, if something tests the old trigger finger, we'll let it test it. Got in the blind and there's a doe, year and a half old doe in the plot. She never even knew I came up into the blind. That's because we got it nice and walled off. So look at look at the size of that turnip in her mouth. Massive turnip. They chew the end of the turnip and then they drop the rest and then they don't pick it back up. I mean, bro, don't waste your food. Sixty-nine point six yards, that little bastard. Just 
just standing there looking all cocky. It's tempting to watch one. It was a pretty cool night. I saw at least seven. I had those two, two little bucks out in front of me sparring, eating apples, eating clover all night. I mean, they every deer came within bow range. And a uh, little taste of the roots back on the hill was just what I needed, a little refresher. That felt good. I'll get a hunt in with Dad and Dino. Hopefully they saw some deer tonight too, but yeah, it was just good to uh, come up here and enjoy the view. Enjoy the scenery and being right in the middle of them. And they had no idea you're here. That's cool. Wow. Wow. And I love when you can just hear that. The crickets, the peepers, the tree frogs. Silence in nature. It is so 
therapeutic. Kind of expected it to be, but super slow night. Just saw the two, one little doe, not little doe, but second year doe and a little unicornish bike. It's gonna be warm this week, so I'm not gonna be hunting a ton. Cold weather is in the forecast though.